Let's talk about how you can get free movie tickets using Scotiabank credit card points. In this video, we'll talk all about what tickets cost nowadays in Toronto, how much points you need to get a free ticket, how much money you need to spend to earn those points, and also what kind of credit cards from Scotiabank are eligible to earn points. But first, for all those of you who are new here in Canada and have no idea what movie tickets cost here, movie tickets, like everything nowadays here, are so expensive expensive. Nowadays, tickets for adults cost $13.50 and if you book them online in advance, there's also a booking fee of $1.50. Add HSD to that and it comes to $16.96. Plus some popcorn and drinks which can cost you $7 to $10. You can easily spend $25 to $30 for one cinema trip. And if you go and watch VIP, which is an awesome experience by the way, you'll need to pay $23.50 plus the online booking fee plus HSD and that amounts to $28.25. So if you are a frequent moviegoer then I think that it totally makes sense to get the Scotiabank credit card. But before I continue guys just a very big disclaimer I am not a financial advisor or financial consultant. All I'm trying to do here is sharing with you my personal experience in the hopes that it might be useful to you. Anyways since I and my husband moved here to Canada Toronto we went to the movies about three to four times a year and we never paid for a movie ticket even when watching VIP and since we've gotten so used to it I'm also not planning to pay for a movie ticket ever again since we have that Scotiabank credit card it's just too easy to collect points while shopping for things that we would buy anyway and just wait till we have enough to go to the movies and by the time there's a really really great movie out there that we just have to watch on the big screen Dune for example instead of just streaming it at home we usually have enough points to get us one pair of tickets plus some popcorn and some drinks. So now let's get into how this works. Scotia Bank's credit card program is called Scene Plus. By the way, why do all companies nowadays have that plus at the end of their name? Like Apple Plus, Paramount Plus, but anyway. And if you have a Scotia Bank credit card which is part of the Scene Plus program, you can use your credit card to collect points that you can use not only for watching movies but also for traveling, for dining, for shopping and others. But in this video, let's talk specifically about movie tickets and how you can get them for free. But before I continue talking about how you can redeem your Scotiabank scene points for free movie tickets, if you found this video useful so far then please do me a favor and hit the like button. Thank you. So the big question, how many points do you actually need to get one free movie ticket? The basic conversion ratio from points to dollars is 100 points to $1, which means that 100 points will be enough to get you $1 in movie ticket. So that means that if you get a standard ticket for an adult at $16.39, you will need to have 1,639 points. But the great thing is that you do not need to pay your entire ticket in points. So let's say that you need 1,639 points but all you have is 1,000 points. At checkout, you can simply redeem 1,000 points and pay the remaining $6.39 in cash on your debit or credit card. And of course, you can do any other combination you like. And you can also use your points to pay for popcorn, snacks and drinks and that is what we usually do. And by the way guys, this is an example of a very frugal outing. So we use our Presto cards to take the bus to go to the Cineplex and over there we use our points to pay for the tickets and for our food so we do not spend a dollar or a loony. And now you might be thinking, well fine, I need like 1600, 1700 points for a ticket, but how much do I need to spend on my credit card to earn that number of points? So now let's get into the details first for how you can earn those points and later on let's take a closer look at whether or not it's worth doing this at all. So to know how many points you can earn if you're a member of Scene Plus, simply go on this link sceneplus.ca, how it works and you can see a table of different partners and see how many points you can earn on different transactions. And I would say that it varies widely. You can earn the highest number of points by spending your money at a Cineplex and the Cineplex store. There you can get 5 points for every $1 spent on movies and entertainment purchases. But if you use your scene credit card to dine at one of these places here, Harvey's, Swiss Chalet, Eastside Mario's, Montana Barbecues, etc., you will only get 1 point for every $3 spent and that is very very little. So anyway, you can check out the details for yourself and how many 
many points you will earn will largely depend on your spending habits where you shop how much you shop etc but on average it is safe to say that you can earn approximately one point for every dollar spent which means that if you spend $1,000 on your credit card, on average, you will get approximately 1,000 points. And those 1,000 points will get you $10 in movie tickets. And again, this is a very rough estimate, but I do hope that this will give you a ballpark figure. Now let's get back to the tickets. So if you need 1,639 points for one ticket at an average conversion rate of $1 in spending to one point, that would mean that you need to spend about $1,600 to get one one free movie ticket and by the way guys note that this is one standard ticket for adults because ticket prices can vary based on the type of studio and also whether it's VIP or not and there are also different prices for seniors and youth and I know guys now you might be starting to calculate in your head $1,600 how long does it take me to spend that much money on my card so in case you're new here in Toronto or you haven't been living here for too long I can tell you that it takes almost no time to spend six sixteen hundred dollars here let's just say that you spend about one thousand dollars per month on various things like groceries eating out fuel your mobile phone plan and so on but let's get real usually you would not only have one credit card but most likely you would have at least two credit cards and let's just say that because you also buy a lot of stuff on Amazon and you want to get more points on that let's say you put five hundred dollars for your Amazon purchases on your brim credit card and by the way guys if you want to know more about this credit card that earns you double points for Amazon purchases then you can check out this video up here and of that $1,000 you put the other $500 on your Scotia Bank SIEM credit card that means if over three months you spend about $500 on your Scotia Bank SIEM credit card then after three months with a spending of about $1,500 you would have about enough to get one ticket so if anyway you are spending that much money on your expenses and anyway you are also a frequent moviegoer then in that case I would say that getting a Scotia Bank credit card, a scene credit card, makes a lot of sense. And now let's get to the next important thing. Which cards specifically are actually eligible for the scene program? Because not all Scotia Bank credit cards are part of the scene program. So simply go to this link over here and head over to Scene Plus and scroll down here, click on credit cards, and here you will see all the credit cards that are part of the scene program, which includes Scotia Bank Scene Plus Visa card, Gold American Express card. Scotiabank Passport Visa Infinite Card, uh, Scotiabank American Express Card, and Scotiabank Platinum American Express Card. And if you're a student here in Canada, there are also SCENE cards specifically for students. And actually, it does not even have to be a Scotiabank credit card, but it can also be a debit card. So here are some of the debit cards that can also earn you SCENE points. So for example, this Ultimate Package Debit Card and Preferred Package Debit Card, and if you happen to be a student here in Canada, you can also get a student debit card to collect your scene points. For example, the Student Banking Advantage plan. So with this, guys, I hope that you too never have to pay for a movie ticket here again and you can use that money for other things. And by the way, guys, in case you're new here in Canada, if you want to start building your credit history, it's really, really important to get your first credit card as soon as possible. And honestly, it doesn't even really matter which credit card it is. Just get one first and start building your credit history and in case you want to know more about how you can build a very good and excellent credit score as fast as possible here in Canada then you might want to check out this video over here thank you so much for watching guys and I'll see you in the next video